Yo, what up? Welcome to Black Savage Entertainment. If you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe, hit the like button, and turn your notification bell on, and leave a comment below. Yo, we back with another one. We got Wack 100. He speaks on BG being a rat and reacts to news of Birdman allegedly hanging out with BG during the Super Bowl weekend and further doubles down on his position about exposing rats. So I'm gonna play this content, man. Let the content content, and we're gonna get back at the end of the video. Make sure you like the video. Yo, drop me a sub and let's get to it. Hey, say what? You you seen uh Jizzle with Birdman the other day, huh? Seen who? BG. You seen him with Bird oh, the other I day? See, no, I ain't seen nothing. Where he at? They might have been together. Shit, you don't tell me where he going, nigga grown. It was somewhere in, in Vegas, probably at the Super Bowl. I don't know. Oh yeah, the nigga in the halfway house in Vegas. Birdman was definitely in Vegas over the weekend. It, it took pictures. Well, what you what you want me to do about it? You telling me for a reason? Nah, I'm just saying. They were back you, together. What you saying? I'm saying they back together. So you think because they took a picture, they back together? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's what you say. Was it the contract in the picture? Not like that, man. They uh, cool. I don't know what you're saying. Like, I, I didn't know when was they, they cool. when, when, when was they saying. not cool. But when was they not cool? Well, you know how they was. I, I, I just was talking about it. If you read between the lines, you think they Nah, not cool. don't, don't say that. Because when I said that, y'all said I didn't know what I was talking about. Y'all said he didn't say nothing wrong. See, this is this would be weird by Shit. This would be weird about it's like if Wax say it, I automatically just say the opposite. But then now you let some time go by, and now just saying, yeah, dude was kind of saying some. And that's real. Sh Come on, bro. Nah, I caught that. Nah, but when I said nah, I was talking kind of greasy, bro. <clears throat> nah, Wax, you just a bro. I'm just telling you what I'm hearing. Bro. Like, I'm kind of greasy. You know, I don't know. Birdman gonna take that every you take that. It's like, oh, Birdman sent you at me. Birdman ain't sent me at shit. Birdman can't tell me to do nothing, can't stop me from doing nothing. Get every day confused. That be crazy to me. What you, you, you run Cash Money West, huh? No, I mean, if that's what I want to do a prop, a, a thing on it, then I will. But, bro, whack don't work for no, no do whack work for. Don't no control whack. No, not even y'all fake God. Y'all ain't, you ain't realize that? That whack is his own man, his own boss, do his own I work with a lot hey, of God people. is crazy. Yeah, it is, because that <laughs> makes me. It's real Like, you know, I don't believe in that shit. I'm not no Shay, so uh, I'm not no fucking sheep or fucking slave. You know what I'm saying? To really sit down and think about this fake. Every mother in the Bible is a disciple. All the disciples was killers, murderers, rapists. So what the fuck I give a fuck about what they had to say? Would make their word and their ideology any better than what mine is, if they even exist. There is no book of God. The book of God does not exist. You cannot show me a book of God. You can show me the book of Luke, book of Peter, book of Andrew, book of John, book of Ecclesiastes. You can show me all them books. You cannot show me a book of God. It doesn't exist. So I don't fall off into the brainwash. I just don't. It's real shit. So I think y'all be confusing that, you know, whack doing what somebody tell me to do. Now, if you call me and put something in front of me and I look at it it's a been hitting me every fucking day I just told him you run it keep sending it to me for so keep sending me some shit. what is this some shit name no who this is is a rapist he didn't send me the paperwork on the man I don't know this thing like you got a problem with this you run it some name Chris Chris unbiased or something. <clears throat> some battle rap, bro. I don't know, bro. I see the got some. Shit. You run it. Yeah, I don't know the. Shit. 
you know, if I don't know it, that shit, I ain't gonna talk about it. But if I know you, I'm gonna fry your ass up. That's a fact. Right. But I think y'all, you know, well, I'm trying to make you fight his battle. <laughs> well, cause whack for bird man, and whoop, look, Stunner gonna tell you, but I'm gonna tell whack if a rat, rat, you know what I'm saying? You can't call and tell me nothing. You gonna tell me? You know what I'm saying? What you gonna say? Yo, whack, I know. Right, he can't tell me that. You know that. I never said they would. I don't know what they doing. Whatever they doing is they doing. Stunner, grown man. Stunner didn't like me with six nine. Did it stop me? He hated it. See, that's why I was going there with it. I'm gonna let you can't go at all. nothing with it because Wack is his own man. Don't know. Me. Run no. me, control me, tell me nothing. No, no crip, no blood, no, no. I think y'all don't get it. Like, I don't know, I don't work for no. no f I hate rats. That was, that was my point. Well, I mean, you know, he doing whatever he do. I don't know. Ask him. Go to his Instagram and ask him. He might respond. Whatever he do is what he do. Maybe putting together the tour. Maybe it's business. I don't know. Don't give a Everybody give a about what I do or say. I don't give a fuck about what no do or say unless I want to give a fuck. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> That's it. It's a bunch of rats out here that I know about. You know, I had a talk with two of them today. Hey, you know you's a rat. You think I didn't know? I've been hearing little things. You were saying my name in interviews. I hear that shit again. I'm expose your ass. You hear? Whack. I don't want no problems. Okay, cool. All right. One out of Compton. One out of New York. One a new rapper. One supposed to be an OG Crip used to be on this act. Whack. I don't want no problem. Okay. That's your warning. That's it. I don't really. F with people unless they f with me bro but here goes the thing people tend to think well whack I only did this so why are you going so far you can't tell me how far to go when you didn't start with me I'm an Aries I'm telling you right now I'm an extremist so I'm gonna give you warning I'm going to go too far I know I'm gonna go too far leave me the f alone yo whack I think you got Ray Donovan covered I don't know who the f that is. That's that. You ain't seen that show? Nah, I don't know who that is. Oh, know. you gotta check that sh out. Your trip. <clears throat> yeah, I tell you. bro. Other than that, leave me alone. Now you wanna play, play, but don't tell me how far and how much I can do. That don't work like that, bro. I only threw a pebble at you. I'm gonna throw a mountain at your ass. It's a fact. I believe in overdoing, overdo overkill over I'm telling you I'm, I'll be warning and then they come playing <clears throat> and then they get mad but why did you have to nah you can't dictate how far I go who the f*** told you, you can't that? tell them how to respond yeah who the f*** told you that you know I told you that we just exposed it I ain't told no don't like the music or don't stop streaming. We just expose it as a rat. You know, we really working for the streets. If you was attempting to do something with him, you shouldn't be doing. Maybe because he was, you thought he was a real. Well, here it go. You know what I mean? Does that information help? Oh hell no. We ain't doing that. To all the fans, keep being a fan. Shit, I ain't shit. Stream. Do all that. Write him a letter. I don't give a. I had to tell him the other day. So you mad at me because I can read. You mad at me, but you ain't mad at the that I'm reading about. This is why the streets is a mess. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> mad at me because I can read. They ain't mad at the that I'm reading about. Especially the new streets. They ain't nothing like the old. 
something really solid. They not mad at they not mad at what I'm reading about. They mad at me because I can read. Some of this I be hearing out here, I'll be like, man, I'm happy I ain't a part of this. I don't give a but if I did, y'all motherfuckers would be pain. <clears throat> Everything's different. Funny. Tell not to join. Hey, bro, unless you just for to get out and start trying to clean house, but you'll never clean house. Go your way, bro. Hey, man, so that's pretty much the end of the video, man. It's a lot of rappers that are getting exposed to be rats, man. I think when we were coming up, we were always... Uh, led to believe that the streets was this super real place that everybody had a sense of loyalty um, nobody talks to law enforcement nobody gives up their friends during the commission of a crime so we've been told this most majority of our childhood growing up those who have been close to the streets one foot in one foot out whatever the case may be but now it's being exposed that a lot of people that we looked up to are rats now, Wack One, he gets a lot of heat for exposing and bringing a lot of these things to the light. And I don't understand why. I mean, I thought we wanted these type of individuals exposed and brought to the light so everybody that's still actively involved in the streets could alert themselves and stay away from these individuals. If you're in the music industry and you're doing business, I don't think somebody snitching is going to dictate you doing business with them only because that the business in the music industry is not a legal activity. So that really has no bearing on that person's performance in the business world. But it's something to keep in mind if you do come from the streets and most of the rap industry does, um, they're not going to want to associate themselves with people who testified against their homies, turned on their whole gang. So I gotta salute WAC 100 for exposing all these dudes that claim this street life. They betray these gangster image. They say they're an OG gang member, um, this and that. But somewhere down the line, there's some mystery in your history and all the stuff that you did under aliases is coming to the light. A lot of these guys are rapping, I mean not rapping, but snitching under aliases and expecting that this will never come to the light because nobody knows me by this alias. They go out of town and do some dirt and come back to their home and, you know, everything's good. But salute to Wack 100 and the Hunter side for exposing these dudes, man. Keep your foot on their neck, Wack. And if you're new to this channel, you made it this far, do me a favor, subscribe to the channel, like the video. It helps us reach more subscribers. And look, man, let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. You don't got to agree with what I'm saying in this video. If you're opposed to it, put it in the comments. Let me know. But, yo, until the next one, man, peace.